the once formidable party. Amen. Jubilee. A formation that was envied by rivals in the run-up to last year's elections and was showing signs of a force to sweep the landscape for years. I and we are. The Jubilee ship was built after TNA and URP joined hands in a coalition in 2012. But now the ship appears to be on the brink of sinking. This one looks like more of a come we stay relationship uh, that has ended up uh, being like a one night stand kind of thing. The Swahili equivalent for self inflicted pain. Indeed, the state house bromance that existed in the early days of the Uruto administration has since disappeared, and public feuds have played out between loyalists of President Uhuru Kenyatta and his deputy William Ruto. A recent declaration from the ruling party's vice chairman, who has since resigned, confirmed that indeed the Jubilee House is in trouble. Part of the conflict came from people who did not understand who was running Jubilee. There has been this matrix, this mantra from a lot of people of saying that Jubilee is run by Uhuru Kenyatta and William Ruto. No political establishment is run by two people. Scobbles in Jubilee appear to be a script that has been stirred by suspicion, internal wrangling and ultimately all boiling down to the 2022 Uhuru Kenyatta succession debate. According to insiders, things started falling apart during a parliamentary group meeting at State House immediately after the 2017 general election in which the head of state barred Jubilee leaders from engaging in politics for the four years till 2021. In his address, it is intimated Uhuru Kenyatta made it clear that all the energies be directed towards the realization of the Big Four agenda that could translate to his legacy upon his retirement. So they say MPs loyal to the DP then felt that such a plan will derail his presidential ambitions with some casting doubt on whether the Mount Kenya region will back root for the presidency in 2022. Yeah, and he said it. He said in the last year he would campaign. For his, for his deputy. The people who have been trying then to pressure him to repeat it, declare again, say it in public, are people who have completely lost focus and gone off script. Because then we said it is true. We have these promises to make, to deliver. We have this work to do. We want to unite our country. We need to fight corruption and need to transform it through the big four. So for them to try and draw him back into that conversation, of course you will not get an answer. Because that is not what we're supposed to be doing now. The mistrust, the seeds of mistrust and the divisions can only, can, can only widen, even with the exit of one David Morade, who really uh, seems to be speaking to a particular constituency. He's not just talking the way he's talking out of nowhere. We will do nominations from the MCA to the level of governors. But on the issue of presidential backfire of Jubilee, the automatic presidential candidate for our own is his Excellency the Deputy President, Dr. William Ruta. There is no written agreement of who follows who. Because we wanted to create the depersonalization of, of politics. In, in the agreement, even the name Uru Kenyatta does not exist. Even to be the presidential candidate in 2017 or even in 2013. The, his name does not exist. In fact, in 2013, it was that this party, through its processes, will produce a candidate. And this other party, through its processes, will produce a deputy. That's what it was. Because we were saying, let's create a way through which, through party processes, if they don't want him, let, him, let them leave him in peace, but let them not call him names. We are tired of what is going on. We want to know who is who in this leadership. The president has avoided questions about his succession plan, a complete departure from times between 2013 and 2017 when he showed unmatched value and support for his deputy. There are people who assume that they can determine where Jubilee goes. As far as I'm concerned, the only person who's going to determine where Jubilee goes is Uhuru Kenyatta. Enoxicolia, Runinga citizen.